Hi guys and girls, I'm Obsidian Ant and welcome back to my playthrough of House of the Dying Sun. We haven't looked at this message before, so let's have a look. The Emperor is dead, the Royal Guard has been scattered, and the False King sits upon the throne. Execute the Emperor's final edict. Hunt the Traitor Lords. And bring ruin to their people. Lovely. So back to it then. This was the last mission I did, the Physician. That particular path at the moment has come to an end. So we've got two other routes here. We've got the Builder and the Broodmother. I'm going to have a look at the Builder. Duchess Morvo didn't build the Traitor Flagships. She built the Hidden Factories that did. Spies report she is setting up a new factory in Koth. Bring her back alive. But do not spare the crew. Okay, so normally when you destroy a ship, the escape pod of the Lord or whoever you're going after will eject, and you have to destroy the escape pod in order to assassinate the target. Now here it looks like I've got to uh, recover them or bring them back alive. I don't know how exactly I do that, but I guess we'll find out. No doubt I'll make a mistake of some type, knowing me. So defend assault transport hangman and bonus make example of workers plus three destroyers fleet size increases All right, I'm still gonna go with invader for the moment have we got any upgrades we can unlock here so I've only got six points there unfortunately so not enough to oh no what have we got here I can buy a shield extender by the looks of it. Carapace armor, shield extender. Hmm. Do we want shield extender or do we want armor? Let's have a shield extender. Are you sure you wish to purchase a shield extender for five favor? Yes, I do. And at the moment, we still can't change the weapons. Or not really. Not to anything. I'd prefer anyway over what I've actually got. So let's go. Let's launch into the mission. Gorgeous colours here as always. Abduction at the Sanguine Field. Did I see there's only one ship here this time? Oh no, there's my other ship. Right. So there's my objective. That's where we're going to head toward. And you are also going to head toward there. A little matey. What's going on around the field? Right. Let's go in here then and have a look. So that's the uh, they're shipping containers. These are the objectives here. Defend assault transport hangman. Where is Hangman? What have I missed out of here? Oh, so it says to me to the objective and... Go on, both of you over here then. Didn't do a good job right from the start there. Now, someone made an interesting point earlier as to that we probably actually planned the bad guys in this game. All the enemies are actually blue coloured, which is interesting. And if you have a look at the some of the objectives of these missions, they're not particularly friendly, are they? Lay waste to the uh, people of these lords. This one's being particularly evasive here. The force is strong with this one. Come on. Got him. Alright. Where's the hangman? Looks like the hangman is doing okay. Another destroyer over here. Looks like my ally might well be attacking that ship or not. 
You have to got do these missions quickly, it seems, isn't it? Missed my opportunity to do the uh, bonus mission. Alright, one more. Get in there. So out of range, but my ally is very quick to quick off the mark, far quicker than me. Oh, a little bit of an impact on me there. I do like the sound effects when they hit your ship. It's quite uh, got a very kinetic feel to it. There's a load of targets around here. The hangman is hanging in there though. We're not going to uh, do too well here, are we? Sort. Well, we know it's under attack. Trouble is, the uh, flagship is here now, so we're not going to last much longer. The flagship is very powerful and will cause a lot of trouble, without any doubt. Come on. Right, it looks like we might just have made this. Let's have a look. Where is the enemy flagship? Right over here. And it's going to send some fighters over, so... Probably not too good. So, escaping with prisoner. I see. So the hangman's got the... Uh, person on board and that's why we need to defend the ship that makes sense so how do we get out of here there we go time to jump before those uh, enemy fighters get up with us catch up with us and jump okay I was expecting to have to destroy an enemy ship there and then capture the uh, put the person we're actually after but didn't realise they were already in a prisoner ship, already prisoner in a ship. But we did it anyway, nonetheless. But unfortunately, we didn't get any uh, bonus points. That's because I didn't complete the bonus objectives. Okay. Plus three destroyers. While breaking the target, she revealed the location of an abandoned factory, allowing us to fabricate an attack group of destroyers. Their firepower is lacking, but these warships can keep much larger targets busy for quite some time. Use them wisely. Okay, well, only one more uh, route here before we get to go forward. I'm not actually sure if we do get to go forward after this. Maybe I have to backtrack and complete some of these. You can see these are completed. Th uh, well, they got three white dots on here. Some of these haven't. So maybe I've not completed them as well as I should have done. So, uh, hang on, let's just go back and we'll read the overview here. The Broodmother, Priestess Hara, has been spotted training prototype drones in the Firelands. Purge her. Assassinate the Broodmother. Bonus, destroy all ore containers. Well, we can certainly give it a go, and I'm going to go for Invader yet again. So, <clears throat> three destroyers here. Don't have any points to spend on upgrades, of course. But it's going to be interesting to control a slightly larger fleet of ships here. We haven't done this as yet. Right, and now the destroyers I'm going to have to send directly at the Broodmother, perhaps. Let's see what's going on around here. Okay, so well, we've got some fighters there, have we? Are they gone? Not sure what these green targets are. Looks like fighters. So this is a brood mother we're going to have to destroy. And I do know that she's likely to have some significant defences around her. But what I'll do is send the um, I'll send the destroyers directly to that ship. There we go. We'll send the destroyers directly to the brood mother. Might be a bit of a mistake. 
but we'll see how it goes. And this one here, you can escort, escort one of the destroyers. As for me, I'll do the same, and in we go. So the destroyers are quite a lot larger than the interceptors, quite naturally, but they don't pack so much of a punch. I'm going to fly with these for the moment. There's our bonus targets. They're certainly a bit slow, aren't they? Now, you can play this game in VR. I said to mention that in one of the previous videos, and I still haven't tried it yet. I did have a look at trying it on my DK2. Unfortunately, uh, DK2 is not set up with Steam VR on my system. All right, these guys are green rather than blue. I wonder if they're going to cause us any problem. They're coming this way by the looks of it. Oh no, they seem to be keeping their distance. Oh, look at that. So yeah, there's certainly something there with some significantly powerful weapons around there. Just on the other side of this asteroid. So what we'll do... I'll take out these fighters while they take down those high-powered weapons. Flagship here already. Not even enough time for me to fly towards the target we need to get towards. Right. Whoa. Yeah. This is going to be a bit of a tough mission then. I can't actually see everything, what was going on there. So I might have to plan out from the uh, tactical screen here for initially just to, to get an idea of what is actually going on. So, where did that enemy fire come from? Let's once again send the uh, destroyers over here. Yeah, there's some multiple targets around there, flak drones. They're the ones causing the problem, no doubt, so... Let them destroy the flak drones. My other ships can hold back for the moment. No, 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 I don't want you getting up ahead of these guys. Okay. So it's these that are the problems, these flak drones, they're got very high powered weapons on them. The trouble is, by the time these guys get over here, the uh, enemy flagship is en route. Now that's coming towards us this time, is it? Curious. Keep zooming in a little bit too close there. Alright, some fighters there coming up for these ships. We'll attack those fighters. Yeah, keep away from the flag. You can take them out, I think. This is good. We're get, keeping the uh, flak drones busy, I think. Now, look, see the flak coming there to my fighters. Oh dear. I can't see a way around this. Not particularly a good when it comes to tactical things, so. Hmm. Let's have another look here at what we can perhaps be trying. So they're the bonus targets. These are some enemy fighters. And over here, we've got the Broodmother, which hasn't yet launched her, uh, her flak drones. So the uh, destroyers here are all about keeping targets busy, weapons busy, while we fly in. So what I'm going to do is just 
literally go straight in there again. But I'm not convinced that's the way to go about it. Those flax uh, drones certainly have a nice range on them. As soon as I get around this asteroid, they seem to actually attack, which is which is the thing that's causing me a little bit of problem. Right, and then you can see the flak coming in already. Wow. Hmm. So, let's keep the interceptors back for the minute. Well, those flight drones have gone there. Right, I'm going to try that, but keep the, uh... Keep the, um... Keep back myself. take out these fighters for the minute until we know those uh, flak drones have been dealt with is that flak again? I hope I'm not in range of them So this is certainly one of the tougher missions and I'm quite glad I actually waited until now to do this because I probably couldn't have done it without the drones here. Let's have a look. So now my uh, destroyers are now in range. This one's lost his shields. We should be able to go in in any minute I think. Are they taking the flank yet? They're now taking the flank, and I'm gonna head on in there and try and get the broodmother now. Why? Whilst the flanks 100% uh, attacking the uh, destroyers, we're coming from a slightly different angle this time. I'm gonna switch out weapons, and let's go. No flacking again. Oh, come on. One more try then, I guess. I'm going to do the same old tactic as before. I'm going to send these in to destroy that. And meanwhile, I'm going to hold back for the moment until they're there. This guy can defend me. And that's it. Right. What we'll do then in the meantime is we'll destroy some of these other ships, I guess. Hopefully keep out of range of their uh, flank cannons. Flank cannons are a complete nuisance. Oh well, the other guys destroyed them for me pretty quick. Is that one gone? That one's gone. Alright, now we've got some enemy fighters around here as well. How's he been destroyed? I asked him to defend me, didn't I? He's getting too close to those flat guns. Where's the uh, destroyers? They're still not there yet. They do move along, destroyers. I'm going to keep back until they're, they're actually in there. Where are they? I can't believe the other destroyer, when the other interceptor, rather went out his way and got destroyed like that. Come on. I 
Are they there yet? Are you there yet? There they come. They're just coming round, just coming into range. So hopefully I will be able to... No, me? Are you going to stay back here, mate? That's okay. We're not too worried about the flagship just yet. Let's take out these fighters while we're at it. Right, those destroyers are taking some damage. You can see over to the left there. And the flagship is just about to arrive. Right, now let's get from... Let's get in behind the uh, enemy ship here. Oh my goodness. I really don't know. Don't know how to do that one. I'll give it one more try, I think, and then I'm going to have to do something I've never done before, which is give up on this mission for now and hopefully get some advice from you guys. Perhaps you can tell me how I need to do this mission because for now I'm completely and utterly clueless on how to do this. These destroyers are just too darn slow. Yeah, they will stay with me then. And there he goes again. Hmm. No, 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 no. I want to keep away from there. For now, anyway. At least I, that's the only way I can see doing this. I need to get these destroyers into range. I just can't see any other way of doing it, but they're so damn slow. Let's just keep behind them for now. Considering this is on the easiest difficulty as well, so I'm either completely missing something here or this is very, very hard. Right, they is taking some damage now, you can see that. The other ship there is taking out that fighter. I'll just lend some assistance. For the moment anyway, let's see where those... They're in range now with the flat cannon still. They're doing alright. Right, okay. We need to keep the fighter right out of the way. That was the answer. So you will destroy that for me. As will you. Destroy that. And then we're good to get out of here. Come on, destroy it. I'll destroy it myself. If I need to. Oh my goodness. Good, we're done. Oh, that took long enough, didn't it? So, yes, the... Uh, destroyers were the ones that needed to do the job. That was hard work, wasn't it? Much harder than it actually needed to be. We're getting out of here. And we'll see what the next mission is, considering we've unlocked all the missions that are currently available. We'll see what happens next. Oof. I think I made hard work of that, didn't I? Never mind, we're done. Right. Yeah, I didn't get any bonus points, and quite rightly so, although possibly I could have shot those containers, although I suspect those containers were in range of those flat cannons. New weapon unlocked, Omniflak, has been used for nearly two centuries to deter both pirates and missile class weaponry. And here we can see the two new missions over here. We've got the Templar and Slaughter at Tannhauser Gate. Okay. Nice little reference there. 
The Templar from Koth is running repairs at Outpost Goal. We have limited amount of time before her carrier systems are pulled back online. In Zealot has been dispatched to assist you in eliminating the, the heretic, assassinate the Templar, and transport ships that may be carrying families of high-ranking traitor officers are moving through Tanauza Gate. Send a message. Send a few. Destroy marked transports. Oh yes, destroy the families of the uh, of the traitors. Very nice. But we'll be doing that in the next video, I think. As always, thanks for watching. And I'll catch you guys and girls next time.